I'm uh, Jody Roscoe with the Roscoe Group, and I'm here with Allie Alt with Platinum Credit Now. Um, let's talk about student loans and how they affect um, getting um, qualified for a house. Yeah. So defaulted student loans. Defaulted student loans. So you'll see a lot of that. You know, a lot of people um, default on their student loans. Sometimes it's they're deferred and then they've moved from school and they don't get that first bill, so they start going late and then it becomes a collection. So the U.S. Department of Education is the entity that handles all student loans and you'll have a bunch of servicers. So eventually, um, with an unpaid student loan, it goes to a collection company that the U.S. Department of Education has hired to, to collect. And those collection companies usually have a couple different rules that they can follow. And one of them is that they could put a person in what we call a nine-month repayment plan. And um, it has great benefits to it, but it takes nine months. It actually takes 12 months to, to positively affect your credit score. But you'll make these nine these nine month repayments, sometimes 10, and then that puts you back into good standing. Okay. They send those collections back to the U.S. Department of Education who sends it out to a regular servicer that's not a default servicer. And then at that point, um, usually about the 11, 12 month mark, all those collections would then be removed from your credit report, all the student loan collections like they never happened. Oh. Yeah. And then also, because it went into collections, there's all these like collection fees when you go through that nine month repayment plan successfully, they wipe those collection fees off. So it does lower the balance of the student loans as well. Okay, so, it takes time. so what I'm hearing is it's gonna be a year. Mm -hmm. If you've defaulted on your student loan, it's gonna be a year that you go through the program, which mm -hmm. is through the Department of... It'll be the collection company for the U.S. Oh, Department of Education. I always company. suggest call the U.S. Department of Education to find out where it's at and then go from Got there. it. Yeah. Um, but you can get out of it, you can save the fees, mm -hmm. you can get it back current. And, and sometimes then, the monthly fee is zero dollars a month, and you're just you're, it's just time like you're not having to make any payment. But it's yeah, and sometimes I, I'll have some that are paying zero or five dollars or ten dollars. And how much would that be affecting your credit score? So unfortunately, when it's in the nine month repayment plan, your credit's not going to improve. Okay. It, it would be after. So it does, it's not like it improves it. improves a little bit each month. It's just right yeah. a big jump at the end. Jump though. at the end. A huge jump and all like I said all those collections are removed from your credit report so like it never happened so you kind of get a, a pass if you will okay. it is a one-time pass though so if you get into that nine-month repayment plan and you <laughs> fail to succeed in that you cannot do it again uh -huh. so know that you be certain that you're going to follow through um, if you choose to do that uh, there is another way too. let's say um, you don't have nine months so I have clients that come to me and they're like no I have to buy a house and you know, usually two weeks, right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. um, what can you do for <laughs> Give me at least 60 days if you have student loan collections. But um, there is another way, and that would be to consolidate the student loans into a brand new loan. Okay. Um, that will, it takes about 30 to 60 days to complete and go and show up on your credit report. Um, but what that does is that then pays off the collection, so you're no longer getting hit with collection every month, which mm -hmm. is bringing your score down. You get a brand new good standing loan. Uh, the downside to that is any collection fees that you receive because of the default will carry along in that consolidation. They get rolled over into they get the rolled new loan. over into that, so you don't get that break like you would in the nine-month repayment plan. The other downfall is they do not remove the collections themselves. However, the fact that you paid those collections off that were constantly reporting negative is no longer happening, so you see a big jump in your credit score. But it'll still be there in the history. It'll still be in yeah. the history, and that's where we work to try to get to that. Yeah, but it's not always successful. We, well, so we like that, like it never even happened. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So if you have the time, <laughs> the nine month repayment plan's great. But if you don't have the time, there is another way. Okay. To consult with you. That's awesome information. Yeah. Thank you so much. You're Anything so else welcome. on student loans? I think we pretty much it. it. Yeah. Default, not default. Pay them. Pay the interest. Yeah. yeah. Start right. If yeah. You have, if you can now. Yeah, yep. Start right. Yep. All right. Thanks, Allie. Thank I really so appreciate much. it. If you like this video, thumbs up. Subscribe. Yes. All right. Thanks so much. <laughs> Thank Have you. a good day. Bye-bye.